I'm now live streaming to YouTube, to YouTube, whatever. Where is it? Where is it? I think let's see if I am. Just double check here. I've done this in a while. Or if we're alive right now, then uh, ooh, so it's just oh, we're alive. Yes. Awesome. Okay. I'm going to... Here. I gotta do this here. Sorry, I gotta put out some notifications here. I have done... I have not done live streaming on YouTube for a while, so it's been a little bit of time. And I gotta put the right notes in there. Because... There we go. Alright. Good, 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 good. Okay, figured it out. It wasn't that hard after all, so. Uh, let's do this. All right. There we go. I'm just trying to get ready. It's, it's literally been a uh, hot, extra hot minute since I've streamed on YouTube, so. Trying to put out some notifications here because YouTube doesn't uh, give me a lot of ways to share this here. I'm just gonna, okay, so there is that. I can't do Twitter right now. I don't know what's going on. I, um, I, uh, I, I did something wrong on Twitter, so I can't get that to work right here. But uh, welcome everybody to the stream. Hopefully, you're doing all right. Let me know how it's going today. I can see the stream going here. Looks pretty good on my end. Uh, if you see any latency or anything like that, let me know. I probably can change it on the fly. We'll have to see. But um, all right. So what we're gonna do today? If I got, ooh, I got that settled right as well. Uh, I can put on a little. that there we go all right you're playing alone with me jake pliskin how dare you i mean yeah that's fine you can if you want to that's cool how's uh how's it going today i just got done with a lot of my finals in college and uh it feels like my brain is is uh just totally drained i i had to rush this project so fast and like wait did i do this did i do that i'm double checking every little thing and uh i think i got most of it done right but uh i i you know if i i'll be fine if i get a c with it honestly because i i don't know i might have missed i might have missed uh, a part of the schedules as far as the project's concerned but i think Pretty much, I built the whole structure, you know, so I did everything else pretty correctly. But uh, yeah, man, huzzah! So we're gonna have a pretty good time here. I found out too, you can actually use the mouse to click on this. Look at this. Let's let's try this out. See if this works. Um, I was gonna do something differently for today, but I didn't know that I have to start a new file and beat the game to do it. So we're just gonna have some fun just testing out the auto feature and seeing how that works you know and so um according to this according to the stats the the votes i asked people to to pick the the different one between the two last ones and everybody picked mammoth lycian and uh morelva so i get to kind of choose so i'm probably going to choose morelva <laughs> so that's my favorite country to be honest you know can we click on this with the, the little mouse here? Does it show up on the screen if I do this? Is this is it showing up here if I have the, the mouse on the screen? It does! Wow, you can actually see my mouse on there. That's interesting. Alright, well, if you're new to this game, Jake isn't. I'm not. Most people coming here are not really new to the game. It's already been out for a while. But uh, essentially, you can control one of six countries. 
You can uh, lead them to greatness, lead them to conquer the world, and uh, you know, unify the whole planet. Um, but you get to fight some big bosses at the end, and a couple other things. Mostly it's strategic in sense, hexagonal in shape, and uh, fun in pretense. But uh, answer my question before I ask. <laughs> uh, I just, I just really like. It's, I don't think it's because it was the first country I played. I think it was. Was, uh, uh, I just think that they did very well putting the story together and it was a little bit of fun, comical. Um, the, the, the characters have a lot of fun with each other. That's why I like Morelva so much. And I was really happy everybody suggested for me to, to play it. Uh, what is it, two years ago now? I can't even believe that. Is it a year or two? I think it's two years ago now. But I, I can't believe everybody voted to have me play Morelva. Right off the bat, I was I was going to definitely play Holy Ghost of Empire. I was that was like dead set in my mind. I was like, I'm playing this one, and I was like, you know what? I'll put up a voting tally and see if, see what people say. They'll probably pick that. No, nope, everybody picked Morelva, so I went ahead with Morelva, and it was, uh, it was it was definitely a blast. Uh, but uh, yeah, Morelva is such a, a fun country to play. I really like it. Um, I can't say I can't say have like a really least favorite country to play here. It's the same thing with Grand Edition as well. I like all the countries, mostly equally, not perfectly, but yeah. Hey, Frost, how you doing? But uh, yeah, it's um, it's it's a lot of fun. There's a lot of different. I mean, every country's got to have a different story, right? I can't all have the same story. Otherwise, that would be well, uh, that'd be kind of boring, right? But uh, it looks like they did a little editing with this. This looks a little different, doesn't it? This doesn't this. I don't remember all the fire with the pages here. Did I just forget? That? <laughs> I haven't. I, um, I usually watch the intro a couple of times and then I kind of click through it. But I think they must have done a little editing here. Either that or just the fact that my graphics on the, my PC are just so much smoother than uh, on the uh, But how's your day going, uh, guys? Miha Magic, thanks for coming, coming by. How you doing? And uh, Frost, how's it going today? Uh, but, uh, yeah, uh, I might just play on the PC for now. And learn the truth of what transpired in Russia. Or you don't. And then you... Well, I can't think of anything for that. Uh, all right. Renarzia year 781. Five nations and one tribe plunge the land of Renarzia into an era of chaos. Six rulers and their rune knights throw themselves into the flames of war, each with their own hopes and expectations. What will happen? Norsali. Republic of Korea. Holy Ghost of Yeah, no. Mana no. United Islands. Morelva. Yeah, yes. Let's see here. Uh, can I just click? Ooh, I just click right there. Boom. Nice. Confirm. Maybe I'll just use the mouse. Uh, what is it you like about Morelva? Mostly everything. And uh, Stella's, uh, you know. She looks pretty good. Um, she would be my girlfriend if I lived in the game, probably. I probably would do a better job than I do at uh, seducing her. And, you know, we'd live a happy life. And uh, we go pirating and, you know, conquer the world together. And I don't know if I'd be a mage, though. Maybe I'd be a berserker. I'm not sure. I'll have to see. Wondering how the new game controls via Visa. Vis-a-vis controllers or a mouse keyboard. I'm gonna use them right now, so we're gonna 
go ahead and try this. Let's do some custom settings here. Uh, and since I don't have a ton of time today, we'll see if we can get through the game quickly today. I don't know. We'll probably bring it back up, but we'll do a faster run. And I'm just going to check out the auto settings here. So you're like, you're going to let them fight each other? Yeah, I'm going to let them fight each other. So we're going to put this up to... Uh, uh, no, 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 no. Oh. How do we go right? Or do I scroll here? No, go. Oh, I got to click it. There we go. All right, we could do hard. But because I want to try to get through most of it today, figure out how it works... We are going to just do kind of, it's sort of uh, not really a speed run, but kind of close to that in a sense. So I'm going to see how they do. We'll do random, monster capture, allow, quest success rate. Let's get all the stuff. Man acquisition times two. Uh, I don't think it's going to matter. We'll just leave it like that. We're revival Stone Access. I don't even want it. I don't want it. No, definitely no. No, no, no. Okay, that'll be fine. Uh, XP Acquisition. Uh, all times two. Ooh, that'll be interesting. All right. Custom starting. Game. Here we go. All right. Skip the guide. Yes, please. Uh, the guide's great if you need it. If you haven't played this before, I definitely recommend it. But, you know, after you play it once, eh, they keep throwing pop-ups at you and you don't really need it as badly. Works great with my controller. Don't like it all. I have a, a good controller here, too. I'm thinking about using it, but I might use the mouse right now, too. They've got some keys. And I found out, I think they messed up once. We'll have to see. Or else the game just froze. Did the game freeze? Oh, good. Oh, thank God. <laughs> okay. Let's uh, skip here. All right. Let's get into the into the game itself. Let's do some stuff today. All right. Is this the good controller that I've got? I've got a controller where my my analog stick goes nuts and keeps pointing north. I don't know why. But, I, but this one, I guess, is the good one here. All right. Let's build a team. I say we make an all femme fatale team going to the west. Or better yet, we'll do this here. That'll be Stella, Radka, and Sophie. What do you think about that? What do you think about that? I think that'll be cool, but I'd like to know from your opinion here. Uh... So let's do something like this. Gotta try to organize all this stuff. Honestly, my controller that I have here is super smooth. This Uber one is really nice. But let's see how it works with the mouse here. Ooh, maybe better. Oh, that's fast and smooth. Smooth. Let's see. Can we, can we do a switcheroo? No, I don't think we can do that. Not this. It's almost too fast. Okay. Do I want a 30 point buck or a 40 point buck? I'd rather have a 40 point buck. Okay. Good enough. How do we get out of here? We got in here now. How do we get out with the mouse? Mousey? Mousey. Click over here. Click over. I actually got a little extra buttons on my, my mouse here. I can do other things. Scroll down, toggle, remove, back out. Oh, is that escape? It might be escape. I don't want to. No, that might, that might close up the whole thing. Backspace? Oh, backspace. There you go. Check that out. Backspace. Yes. Okay, how do I get into the base info? U. H. What's H key do? Oh, there we go. 
Now, I looked a little bit earlier when I just got it, and they did not change. They did not change the move status here. Like I asked, I asked, I asked, and I asked, and I asked. Please change this to where you're moving to, not where you came from. That doesn't matter to me. Where you move to matters to me, because then I know how to place my guys. But they didn't do it. Unfortunately, they kind of missed the ball on that one. All right. Whoa. Grab and click and pull. Ooh, nice. All right, let's, um, how do I do move? End of phase, pace, info. No, that's not what I want to do. How do I move? Oh, click it. Wait, that should be easy, easy enough. Okay. K, okay, K, K is for confirm, and go there. Oh, mouse might be better. Oh, no, 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 what did I do? What did I do? No, I don't want that. Or maybe not, I'm not sure yet. Uh... <laughs> well, I got him to move there, <laughs> so there we go. All right. Click on there, troops. Oh, no, not consume. We can consume items later, but it's not, it's not nighttime yet, and I has no beers. So we will not consume any. We will not ingest right now. Move. Sophie. Firm. Here, double click. Double click, left click, boom, done. Okay. Okay, cool. All right, we are going to get... Cannot remove leader from leader slot. I... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. The, the mouse might be fa way faster than I'm even used to, guys. This is ridiculously fast with the mouse. It just instantly goes to something. Click, click, click. And it just, okay, I'm just like, okay, hold on. Hold on one second, I'm, I'm slower than you. I'm not as fast at this. All right. Um, you know, I'll practice with the mouse and it, I think it's fun, but honestly, like, Speedy wise, I'm better with the controller. I'm gonna try a controller again. I'll have to practice with the mouse. I'm not really some games I'm really used to with the mouse. This this game I am dead <laughs> Brigadine, I'm definitely not. Uh so Okay, I'm going to go this. Move. Alright, we're gonna put tomorrow up here. We're gonna put uh, a do and Jenny up here. And then Pluto and Tommy, they might probably can quest for right now. Until I can figure something out. Alright, so we're going to go with Big dragon. Let's see what else we can get here. Can we get anything else here? Uh, we don't have much reserves going on right now. Hmm. What to do? What to? No, can't do that. Can we do this? Well, maybe we could do that. 85, 58. 58. We'll get a golem here. That should be good. And uh, guys, if everything sounds all right, let me know. Because uh, I have to... I don't know if YouTube is like, um, my voice is too loud or, or the game is too loud or something like that. Uh, 
have to figure it out. All right, summon. Get one of these. Oh my gosh, this this just feels so much faster than Steam. <laughs> Or stri not Steam, uh, Switch. Everything starts with an S nowadays, apparently. Everything. Okay, so we'll go there. I don't know if I want to get any more guys or monsters right now. I think we'll maybe acquiesce to not. Can we get a 25-pointer here? We can get... Whoa, can't just go away. Can you even see what I'm doing? I almost can't even see what I'm doing. Twenty points. Oop, we could get. Oh, maybe Rodka. We need to get a little bit more. Yeah, this this is so fast. Oh my gosh, I'm loving this. All right, now it's a good time to. Oh, that's going too fast. Get some archers. Or are we going? Yeah, we'll get one more. Or should we get some archers with our front team here? Yeah, yeah, that uh, that does kind of fill up some stuff. That's pretty good. All right. Okay, I think that's the best I can do right now. We're going to quest Galavard. I think he'll have some fun getting some stuffs. Just making sure we're doing the right place. Okay, Min's port side, port side, Glan. Port side, port side, Glan, Min's. All right, we should be good to go. Oh, another thing I want to do as well. No, not that. Let's do options. Settings, audio. Subtitles on. Display fastest, ridiculously fast. Attack animations off. Just to go through this, we'll turn them off. Uh, ally enemy, ally enemy. Well, I guess we, we have a button to, f to figure that out. Combat, fast forward. You know, that's that. That's fine. Camera reverse, graphics, controls, all right, good there. All right. Okay, end of phase. キャプテンステラ。海丸が敵国の情報を整理したので聞いてくれ。ふふ。ふふ。はあ。ガラクタの寄せ集めだと思ったら随分役立つこと<笑> Uh, hey, how's it going, Pringer? I just tried the keyboard. The keyboard works great, um, but I'm still used to the controller, so I'm going to go ahead with the controller here. But um, yeah, and plus also my wrists are kind of kind of worn out. With uh, I just did a huge, I just drew up a huge building. <laughs> it took me two hours. I had to rush through it, and I I just I just got done with one of my finals, and it 
final projects and so my uh, my wrists are kind of worn out for the controller I think I'll probably stick with the or not the controller but the keyboard so I'll stick with the controller for now but um, how you doing man are you excited for the multiplayer everybody else we have a multiplayer we're gonna be bringing up a multiplayer if it's this Friday that'd be great hopefully we can get that going and uh, that will be on my channel but that will be for Twitch uh, I might do some more streams for YouTube but uh, I'll have to find a time for it because most of the time at night I've got Twitch streams running but uh, anyways so we got the Femme Fatale team here what I'd like to do but I can't is class her into a cleric because I need more healers on this team to be honest I got literally no healers going into this fight so this will be fun this will be fun we'll have a no healers challenge for this one battle here even though I'm not even really playing it I'm just gonna let you see what happens there but we're gonna send out everybody we can everybody and their mother is going out to fight uh, bringing got to bring the old battle axe right uh, a few done grabbing some food now to charge my phone before I start again ah cool man Hey, thanks for coming by to uh, technical. No, I'm dreading if I can even wake up for work the next morning. Wake up for work the next morning? Oh, jeez. That's horrible. Prager, why, why is... Why are you so tired? Does, does, do they work you to the bone? What do they do there? I had a job that was really, really tough on me. The boss wanted to make sure it was ridiculously tough and uh it was kind of annoying with that oh after the multiplayer that ah, shouldn't be too bad man uh we're, we're just starting up you know organizing troops moving them around and then you know just getting in some fights the, the thing is when we fight against the ai we'll play for the ai but we can't set them up so if you set up a super strong stack and then the enemy super strong stacks against you if I'm set to play that, then I'll play it, but if you set up a certain kind of stack, the enemy might only stack so much, because the Norgard and the Empire will be facing each other. So we'll get to fight for those battles as well. Uh, whatever that might be, you know? Um, yeah, I just wanted to try uh, YouTube out again, because it's been a long time. And uh, so I want to get both platforms that I already have going, and... Uh, I kind of started streaming on YouTube first, which I think most people have. But I just wanted to do something for YouTube, so we'll probably do some of these in the future, maybe like maybe once a week or something like that, or if I can do twice a week. But I do have a lot of streams at night, so that's usually on Twitch. Uh, NGI always feels so off when there's no cowboy hat on the screen. You feel off with no cut. Do I need to get a cowboy hat? I actually can because I've got. Uh, I got a condition here. Should I go? With, should I go with Cowboy Brigandine again? Do that all over again? Um, I might have to move my. Wait, can my headphones work like this? Hmm. Kind of heavy. The hat doesn't fit on the headphones. I know that for sure. I can do that. No, that'll fall off. Hmm. Ah, maybe later, man. Maybe in a second. Let me get this set up here. I just want to make sure we're ready to go. We can do a battle and be good. Uh, yeah, I, I, I'm also testing out the audio. I, did, I don't know if the TV audio is going to make a double feed sometimes it does that when I'm recording like this so you're hearing the game and my TV speakers going you know making all the sounds and stuff but I figured the headphones would be good right now okay uh, I can't think of anything to do I guess we're done and uh, so let's do this here all right like I told you before we're autoing the whole thing And we'll see if we win. It's just going to come down. This is going to be armchair. You could technically call this armchair generaling. Or is that even the term? I don't know if that's a term. But uh, we're going to be an armchair general here. We're going to see if our troops are good enough to fight the other ones. 
and hopefully they are and we'll see how it plays out like that so so yeah that's that's kind of what we're doing here um, and nice thing with the mouse is I can just go like this zoom out zoom in can grab and click and drag the thing so you might just go like that so uh, that's pretty cool all right uh, and Scylla's eyes are completely soulless because of the art style. Yeah, she could have a little more color in there, maybe. All right, so let's get into this here. And I'm also, we're going to make the speedy too. We're going to see as, see how much we can get done today. Because I do have a stream tonight, Wands or Wednesdays tonight. Uh, oh, wait, no, is it two? Oh, wait, it is Wednesday. Oh, my gosh, why am I forgetting which day it is? Anyways. All right, so what I found out, if you're going to play it, let them do their thing. The best thing to do is put the mages either in the center or off on the sides. But um, seeing as how this game edition is a little wonky with how they place guys, like A, B, C, A, B, C, A, B, C, A, B, C, B, C, A. You know, it, it just goes all over the place. You have no idea where you're going to place them. So you have to actually look there. Now we go to the bottom. Now we go to the top. Sometimes it goes in different ways. I don't know why it does that, but um, we're going to give this a shot. Frames still drop when loading battles. Do they? Do they now? I didn't, I'm not seeing anything at all here at all. This looks just super... The, the graphics here for the PC version is so much better. Well, I mean, I've got a good graphics card, but... One thing that they didn't do as well is they... I told them to take away the HP bar, and they put physical hit points on the character. I want to... Uh, I, I don't want the dots... To, I don't want the... I don't want the Alpha, Beta, and Charlie to go away. I want all the bar to go away <laughs> that's what I wanted oh man they didn't fix that oh well well we're just gonna have to deal right just gonna have to deal all right so I press here we go oh. either in the center or off the sides there's a third option is there it's a third Either in the center or off the side. What, what's the third option you're talking about, too, Technical? Did do you, um. I have to manage any jokes yet? Yeah, maybe we'll get the, maybe we'll get the cowboy hat. Let's see if it, I can fit the cowboy hat. Let me go get it. できがいる。我が力。おお。ここは一気に攻め込むチャンスだな。おお。チャ。行くぜ。<laughs> kind of works. <laughs> oh man! Look at how fast the game goes. This is awesome. I love playing this game. It's super fast. <laughs> I can just go, go, go. You know. Uh oh! Put the controller down. How do you get it? Glorious. It's absolutely glorious. Gotta love it. Look at how fast we're doing this. We're not you know, it's not even that hard. This game is actually quite easy if you think about it. If you really think about it, just think about really, really hard. About how easy it is. Do this. It's super fast. It's super simple. If that's when you were talking about placing mages, you said either in the center or off the side, I'm not sure. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's right. Uh now I feel like a total doofus for asking that question. Uh, yeah, it's um, with the auto placement of some of these characters. You kind of want the auto. You, you want the squishy guys in the middle, so that the bigger, strong guys will sandwich them. You know, you want the meat in the middle. You want the bread on the outsides, and you gotta lace it with some mayo. 
or ketchup, depending upon what you're eating. But yeah. I hate hey, Susu. I don't know what the hell he's saying. Man. But uh, this is good. This is good. Looks like we're winning. I think. I can't tell. Ooh! Oh no! Yeah, you failed. Bye bye. She took you down. Yay! You know what? Actually, this is a, like a really good placement there. I don't even feel hot in the head anymore. You know, usually summertime you wear a big hat. But I don't feel hot at all. That doesn't hold on very well. Let's see. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get some kind of apparatus and like strap it here, so I can put the headphones on and have the hat just balance by itself. You know. Yeah, and I've done this before with. Uh, ah, damn it! Keeps falling off. I've done this before with. Uh, with. Um, you ever played the bouncer? The first game to come out on, on PlayStation 2 way long ago. Gotta be. Kind of an older person to know what I'm talking about. But they had a mode where you could put in a battle mode, and my Paul and I would gamble upon who would win. You could put anybody in there you wanted and anything. How's it going, uh, Valkos? How you doing, man? And uh, so if you care to check this out, I didn't. I couldn't get all the descriptions set. I don't know. I'm still, you know, getting used to the new layout with YouTube, but. Uh, yeah, we're doing auto for this. I'm gonna see how quickly we can get through this. <laughs> so I put everything on auto, I took out the animations, and we're going super super fast. And we're just seeing if we're just we're literally playing armchair general here. We're just gonna see if what we have set is good enough to beat the enemy, right? So that's kind of what we're doing, you know. You on a break? Oh well, that's good. Yeah, it looks like we got a flawless there. Well, I don't know, totally flawless. We probably lost a monster or two, but all of our leaders survived. So when I'm saying like, if you're gonna do the auto and place them there, you kind of want to put the healer in the middle because the healer in the middle, he gets squished by all of the strong guys and the outside they're like, yeah, I'm gonna go fight. And so he stays back, he doesn't get hit. And what's the point of having a healer heal themselves? I mean, unicorn tank, best tank? I don't know about that, Frost. I kind of disagree a little bit with that theory there, but, uh, you know, you can you can believe it if you want, but I, I wouldn't recommend it, especially if you're trying to play a game and get really good, you know? Um, another thing that's fun about this is that you could just play it like this and kind of see what happens, you know? And uh, you might get an, an idea as to, like, what monster's good at this, what monster's good at that. You know, if you keep an eye on it, you check it out all the time. Man, we took an easy battle here. <laughs> this will be good. Umamara will get some good levels here. But, uh, yeah, well, you know, I actually, it's not so bad. I don't mind that they put the hit points on there. I, I, I kind of like that now, but I wish they'd take away the hit point bar because the bar doesn't scale correctly. Now, Valkos, you probably know what I'm talking about, but the bar does not scale correctly at all. And I, I can't keep my head on here. It's just gonna, it's gonna, I'm gonna be like this the whole time, taco neck syndrome. Uh, there we go. But uh, yeah, the, the hit point bar doesn't scale correctly. So when I see the hit points go down, it's like, but how much and compared to what? Why don't you just make a long hit point bar so that if it, you know, like you got a ridiculous amount of hit points like this, someone's got a little hit point like that, then you'd be like, oh, I kind of know where they are now. But with the scaling of the hit point bar, I don't know. I have no idea. You got one that's, you should just take it away. It, you know, if they're going to take something away, just take away the hit point bar and maybe leave the hit points out of the hit points, the min-max hit points there, I think that'd be fine, you know? Because at least you can see the hit points and it's a better way to, to kind of gauge yourself going into battle, like, oh, I know exactly how much hit points. I don't even have to check them anymore. You just look, it's a total visual. 
Get your hat is fine. You're already went above and beyond. <laughs> well, um, if I can do it, I'll do it. But if, but if it falls off too many more times, then I'll probably just take it off. At least this way I've got my hat. You know, because I was doing Cowboy Burgundy for quite some time. Also, if it gets too hot in here, because it's like 80 degrees out right now, and I've got AC on me. But, uh, if I get too hot, then I'll, I'll take it. Ooh, let's get into the battle here. Let's see. Let's get a better angle. Oh! Oh, you know what? I'm looking at on YouTube right now. The light, uh, the quality isn't as crisp as it is right here. I think it's because of latency. I got a, I think I got a low latency setting on the, the stream. That's probably why. It's like YouTube can't, can't keep up with it. They got the other thing. Soon you'll be showcasing the creator mode? Uh, yeah, I'll be going through that. We'll be going through that. I've got a special type of thing I'm going to do for that. I, I don't want to spill the beans until I do it, but the certain kind of gameplay mode I'm going to do with the creator mode. Y'all will love it, and I know I will too. I just I just want to know what I can do, because I have no idea. I, you know, you get the game, you start like, Well, you can't play the creator mode until you play the whole game, sonny. And I'm like, uh, okay, fine, we'll, we'll do it that way. That's fine. So, I like doing this anyways. I like doing this anyways. I've done, I, I've done this... I don't know, a few different times, you know, watching my AI fight for themselves. And I always thought it was interesting if I had, like, a, like an LP where I just did something like that. Just armchair general, set up your guys, let them knock down the pins, see if you did it right, or see if you click on the right battle. I mean, you could be wrong, too. You could, you could get a, uh, you know, you might put yourself in a battle that you just lose. The other thing I'm doing with this is that if it comes to a point where my guys are going to retreat, I'll decide to play the battle from that point forward if I want to. Or I'll retreat. But the thing is, you can't set your guys to retreat. Or, I mean, you can't set your guys to retreat, but if the game gives you the option to set it to retreat, because the game is like, I want to retreat, because this doesn't look very good, if you set them to not retreat and then you hit auto again, it'll keep popping up the do you want to retreat button because the AI will just keep wanting to retreat. So if they ask to retreat, then I'll have to take control because if I want to win, you know. But uh, good solution that has been used in other games to have an increment indicator like a line for every 100 hit points. Yes, something like that would be good. Uh, incrementation with that would be better, but the scaling here it just it's it. Uh, I don't know how to describe it. Game volume is overpowering you a little bit, is it now? I didn't know that. Thanks for that, Valkos. I'll have to I'll have to click on my thing here and uh, let's do this. Okay. Alright, I, I turned on my stream volume for it a little bit. Hopefully that that will do it. Hopefully that'll do it. But um Yeah, we're just gonna just gonna do this. I I did this after I beat everything, I just kinda did this for a while. And it was just a lot of fun to just armchair journal and see if you selected the right kind of knights, the right kind of monsters to put into the fight you're going into. And uh see if it'll work now this one's a little risky we do have one unicorn but you know we got a lot of headstrong leaders here except for sophie she'll she'll probably stay in the back here but um yeah i think the latency that's the, the quality is not as crisp but at least you know we can kind of communicate uh pretty well here it's still set to the highest quality got the highest quality going into it 
so I don't know what I'm gonna what it is it looks a little fuzzy on there but my PC looks like super crisp and sharp I love it anyways all right so coming into here we'll have to see who to place first as to who gets there uh, Sophie is gonna be a little bit behind let's do where does, where does the other team go way over there way over there all right um, let's do Stella and then we'll put Radic over here so so really uh, using the low latency freak uh, feature here I could go higher maybe I don't know if I can can I right now I don't know uh, da -da. can I go uh, stream latency is a delay between when your camera captures when it says normal it's higher quality let's try normal if it if if uh, if if you have any problems, let me know. I'm okay. That looks a little crisper there. Well, or maybe I'll have to wait till I get the gameplay here. All right. So starting here really depends on where you place your troops because the closer you are, the more engaging combat you'll be, obviously. But um, you want troops that are that, that are going to get into battle pretty fast. And you also want troops that get into battle too fast to not get into battle too fast. So I usually put them further away because then the other guys are still moseying their way on up there. And uh, still is already fighting with, like the entire force. So uh, placement is kind of key in this scenario. It's kind of like chess, you know, in a sense. You know, I don't think we got any golems for this team here. No, the golems are on the other team. Oh, and, uh, yeah, no golems. Yeah, obviously, play for for doing this. Well, actually, I do bring golems, to be honest. I'll buy and use almost anything, really. I'm, I'm not averse to that. I'm not averse to that. Let's see how they do this here. Blue snakes? I'm just going to call them blue snakes sometimes. You just have to forgive me for that. But the great snakes, the big whatever the hell they're called. Um, they're great because they've got the best movement. So I'll hire them over dragons for this kind of armchair general stuff. Things with high mobility. Uh, I don't buy golems too much, but I will buy them sometimes. But mostly wyverns, high mobility things, so that those things get around and those things are attacking the frontline instead of my leader taking the frontal brunt of the force, you know? So that's the reason you also see Raka in the back, because if she gets out there and she goes like way up to the front and shoots him in the face, uh, well, yeah, it's good knowing you. Yes. That's why I'm keeping her back. <laughs> so she doesn't like fly out in the middle of nowhere. But the great thing as well is that the giants and the golems who utilize mountain paths very well. So they do the mountain path and stuff. Okay, does that look better? I think that does look a tiny bit better. Oh, jeez, not my siren. No, not my siren. Leave the siren alone. Yeah, take him down. Take him down, Dano. Frost! PDP. We got him with the frost. PDP. <laughs> you know, Frost, I can use your name like that all the time now, or whenever I want to do it. <laughs> cool scenario. I thought of a cool idea earlier. Um, yes, I do have a scenario I'm going to run. Uh, I don't want to tell everybody right now, but I probably will the day of. Um, if you want to talk about your idea, uh, you can. If it's the same exact thing as my idea, then uh, I'll, I'll let you know. But if it's not, then I'll uh, I'll wait. But I don't think I don't think your idea is gonna be the same as mine. But uh, 
Anyways, you know, the more the merrier if you want to do some... You know, dude, if you want to do challenge mode stuff with me again like we did before, we could do that. You remember how much fun that was? <laughs> we just have all these different challenges. No! I lost my siren! Ah, oh, the siren's gone. Sound of the siren. Oh man. Ooh, we took him down. We took it down. Good, good job. Good job, Doggy. Good job, Doc. Hellhound. Oh, and this is uh, experience times two for everybody. So the enemies can also level up ridiculously fast. You know? But, uh, hey, you know, man, if you want to do that with me, that'd be cool. And if Frost is up for that, too technical. If you want to do some stuff with me with that as well, let me know. We can have a lot of fun. Falcos and I did this in the past. And we do our own different streams where we give the opposite streamer a challenge. And, uh, I think I won the last one. I don't know. Wait, who won that last one? I can't remember anymore. I was like... Yes. It was like five years ago we did that. It's gotta be. You gave me a really hard challenge, a counter kill challenge. It, just could, it didn't happen and then finally, finally, in the next LP it, it finally happened. But it didn't happen at one time. These counter kills are so incredibly rare. That's more of a... Yeah, that is kind of a challenge, but still kind of... It's just a, I don't know, this is such a what-if scenario, you know? No, you missed! Where's my dragon? Where's it? You're killing all my stuff here, that sucks! Can, can you please freeze them up, Sophie? Oh, good. Good, good, good. Counter kill is very tough. Yeah, that's true. My my teams are suffering here. They're suffering from the innate uh, 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 death scenario. Uh, notice level up in Renarzia was much faster than, than foreseen. It took me off guard how fast lies eleven despite. Sorry, she might get up to level twenty. This battle, well, especially with the times two. I've got times two experience on everybody. Not just me. So it's it's fair to the enemy, actually. You really want to do that? That is shocking. I'm surprised he didn't run away. You see that? He went for an attack. He can't even possibly hurt her at all. She's just not... She, Vane, you did all that in vain. Literally. You, I can wordplay your own name there. All right. Get a probably level 10. Yep, level 10. Nightmare. Oh, level 11. Wow. That was more than I thought. Ooh, a nice frost. A nice frost PDP to the enemy. I'm surprised Frost never utilized that you know, on its own channel with that. He, he, doesn't, he doesn't say, I'm going to use a frost PDP. Yeah, why the hell would I want to retreat right now? No. We're doing fine. <laughs> We're doing fine. Why do you want to retreat? So this is the other thing. If it comes to retreat, and I want them to keep playing, if I go to auto again, watch what happens if I do auto. You want to retreat. It'll just force me into a, a possibility of retreating. When I've got the upper hand, he's down to two monsters. Why the hell would I retreat right now? Go kill him. Get out of here. Uh, can't even imagine how fast she times XP will be. Well, it's this fast, dude. We already got level 10s and almost level 20s. Goes up times 10 in creator, but times 10? You're kidding me, dude. You have like massive level ups like instantaneously. Okay, our our army took a really huge massive hit. We're gonna need to do a lot of reorganizing here. Oh gosh. <laughs> okay, she's already proficient. We can get her into a healer. 
But look at that. Look at how small of a force it took. Just having one healer is, is oh, it just, yeah. Yeah, man, that's fuel for fuel for the fire, right? You know, this is this is not a game. If you love Pokemon so much, this is not a game you're going to enjoy uh, when you're throwing your monsters out there like that. They just get crushed. Uh, the good thing is, though, you can revive them with Revival Stones, and you can put a setting in, you get Revival Stones all the time, uh, you know? Uh, so it, it's, it's weird. It's like right at the end, there's just two leaders left. They have literally nothing left to, to do, and then she's going to retreat. The thing is, Stella would have retreated, and then he would have retreated as well, and it would have gone back and forth between who could retreat the fastest. And it's like, come on, you you would clearly have the advantage here. Let's let's push this, right? So I don't know, whatever. We'll have to get we'll we'll have to get those guys back here. All right, Umaro recharged. Umaro is my is my one of my favorite leaders here. Might be my favorite leader here. Okay, that is uh, Galavard story there. Got a guard hat. Crimson rod. Ice breastplate. Oh, yes! That for leaders? Ooh, Mara's gonna love that. Let's go and do that right now. Okay, let's get... Oh, yes. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, 135 to 140? It's not that much, but it does give me a blue dot and some defense. It's pretty good. All right, let's do some classes here. All right, we could go Ranger. Go Ranger Rick. Or we could do something else. Only Pokemon worth playing is Nuzlocke. Oh, I think I've heard that before. Yeah, I mean, you could... You could uh, this game is actually really soft on that. I mean, if you get a Revival Stone, you get back the same monster. It's not like they're permanently lost forever. Now, Grand Edition is a little more brutal with that. Because Grand Edition makes sure you never get that monster back. You've got to grow a whole new one. And that's what you got to do. Alright, so for this... Um, Rangers are kind of okay... I like them when I can use them. I like them when I can actually use them myself. But when the AI is using them, that's a whole other matter. So I think we're going to go the safe route, pick a fighter, just so we get some residual HP back. I know we're going backwards in time, but at least he might get some evasion off that too, you know? And that could be worthwhile. Phoenixes are the best. Maybe I'll get a Simurg. Maybe I won't. I don't know. I'll think about that. Let's do some re-ups. Work is 160. Wow, I didn't even think about it. I was just like, go over there and over there, and then we're done. All right, 165. We're going to move everybody back. I'm going to come back here. Going to exchange some stuffs. You know, actually, the mouse is faster, believe it or not. Believe it or not. You remember that show, Valkos, and uh, Two Technical and Frost? Remember, believe it or not, with uh, the guy that played Superman in the Lois and Clark series. Well, I think there were a couple different hosts, but I think he was the main host in that one. It's possible. Yeah, I think it was. I think so. Ooh, 40? 40. Bring a Dean with... Naughty words, Frost. Naughty words. I have to keep putting the show button there. <laughs> YouTube is very strict about those words. They're like, are you sure you want to show that? Because it's very naughty. All right. We got 40 left here. We can get some other stuff. This is awesome. I can, I can, I'm going from controller to mouse and just on the fly, however I want to do it. It's nice. Very nice. I love having, I love having options, you know? All right. Class. Everybody, vote in chat. What do you want to see, Pegasus or Nightmare? I will give you that option. A Peggy or a Knight. Be cool. Pokemon. Uh, Valka's rolling with the surprise scenario. My dream creative mode is pretty simple. Two huge, equip potent countries with a lot of knights. That's a very good way to go. Uh, 
Yeah, man, you can go between the two. Believe it or not, I believe it was. Yes, Ripley's Believe It or Not. I forgot the first word. But yes, that's his. Rise of Streaming on YouTube is just kind of a thing we're all going to do now. Like, the entire... You know, we're just going to go from Twitch to YouTube. Well, I'm just going to do this for, like, today. And maybe we'll do some other days in the future on YouTube. But I'm still sticking with the Twitch stuff. Because I've quite built that up quite a lot. And YouTube is usually where I uh, put my... VODs that stay forever, so it's kind of like one is one is permanent and one is for the night time And I kind of put one back and forth. I could go both Obviously, but uh, depends on the time now that I just got through my final class frost like I'd like to use the mouse more, but I'm feeling a little carpal tunnel with with my giant building. I just drew in like two hours so Controller is nice and easy on the hands nice and easy just using YouTube because it auto saves videos, and that's a good thing about it too. Uh, go, nightmare, Balco says nightmare. Anybody else object? Do we have a nay in in the chat, or do we have yays? A yay for nightmare, a nay for a horsey sound. Ooh, someday we've got to get an art stream of you designing a house. Uh, yeah, maybe we could do that in the future. I'm, I I have a vacation at the end of the month coming up. I'll be gone for about a week and a half. I think I can get, I think I can get the stream to work on my PC, but I'll probably just play Burgundine or some simple thing, maybe a chess thing or something like that. But that'll have to be those nights because I. I'm, I won't be here to, to use my my high-tech software, you know. Nightmares uh, keep heal and Rhodarzia, so I don't know. Hard choice. Okay, well, I guess we'll go Nightmare here. Vakos, you have got your wish. Nightmares are good, though. Although, I find it odd. I find this odd. You know how they got the conflicting armor where you got white and black dots, right? Why is the not... Why don't they make him a zebra since he's got half heals and half evil spells? They should make him a zebra instead of a nightmare, right? And then if we're a true nightmare, then it wouldn't have any heals at all. It would just be, you know, it'd just be a straight-up nightmare. But, you know, obviously with the heals and cures and the weakness and the magic downs, black and white, why don't they make it a a day stallion? <laughs> it's just, or a day, a day, no. That would be... <clears throat> well, yeah, maybe that could work. I was thinking of another word. Knight. Knightesis. Knight. Knight. Knight Pegasus. I don't know. Anyways, we got to get some more stuff here. But, uh... Yeah, thanks for coming by, Valkos. Uh, it's good to, good to see you again. Um, yeah, if you didn't know, Valkos is one of the first... Uh, players in the multiplayer that I do on Fridays and uh, well he was actually actually technically Valkos you're the third uh, sorry man but it was uh, myself Paul and then Valkos came in and then we had uh, Metallic Mike for a bit and now Prinker is a part of it so Prinker is probably in the chat so he's still probably excited to do some of that but if other people do want to come by, they do want to play the, the multiplayer with us, let us know uh, what you want to do. Uh, we're mostly doing it on Fridays. If we can try to do something on Saturday, then Valkos might work a little better with what you were saying. But it's probably going to be like Friday. Friday evenings we do the multiplayer. So that includes playing Grand Edition. And that includes playing with a lot of people that uh, want to have a fun you know, friendly banter with that. And, uh, oh yeah, I forgot to mention, last but not least, it's Frost. <laughs> no, actually, wait, wait, let me let me technically go over this. Okay, so it was me, and then I was playing with Paul, and then I started putting on YouTube. And then it was uh, Valkos, and uh, Mike was kind of like there at the time too. So yeah, so one, two, three, four, Valkos, then Frost, then Pringer, and, uh, so if we get if we get more people in there, we if we get six people to play, we have a six-player game. Uh, we do have some set rules. We've added some new rules 
that we haven't had before, but I think they're for the best. And uh, going forward and all that. But what we do before we set up the multiplayer, we have a day where we actually uh, talk about it. We you know go through everything. If there's anything else that you guys want to talk about, like I say, bring it up on the day we have the meeting, so we know what house rules or main rules we're going to play by, so that we have a fun game and uh, nothing's missing. But uh, there are definitely some things that come up sometimes, and we can you know definitely drum up some time to uh, sets you know uh, make sure everything's getting done correctly you know but uh, more female horse stallion may equals male horse oh mare I, thought I said more Fe mare female horse stallion stallion male horse oh yeah 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 that's right what if I could have any free time ah Jake yeah, sorry to hear that man but um, that'd be fun. Anyways, we got a lot we got to summon for here. We have so much to summon. Unbelievable amounts. 80, 190, and 216. Basically, I should just summon everything. Or should we go cheap, cost efficient, and just... I think we're going to have to. I think we have to. <laughs> Free time. Yeah, I'll be uh, doing a lot more work with uh, videos. Triangle strategy is eating up so much of my time. It's unbelievable. I'm doing every battle on triangle strategy. So if you haven't seen that, go check that out on YouTube. It's a lot of fun. These battles in triangle strategy, I'd have to say, are harder than, uh, than Final Fantasy Tactics. I love the story of Final Fantasy Tactics. I love the characters in Final Fantasy Tactics. I love the gameplay in Final Fantasy Tactics. The story in Triangle Strategy is pretty good, but there's parts of it that it's like, I literally would never do anything like that. I, I would completely disagree with most of what Benedict has been saying to our character so far. I think he's got a lot of things wrong, actually. And uh, I'd go a completely different route, but as fun as the story is, the battles are just so, so, so good. They're so good. Because once you get through it, you just feel like, wow, I accomplished all that. It's kind of like, it kind of like if you, Triangle Strategy is kind of like if you combine Bombout Lagoon with Final Fantasy Tactics, whereas you can actually use the field uh, with traps, you can burn the grass, you can freeze the ground. Uh, the only thing they didn't do in there is if you freeze the ground, if you get knocked back, the freeze, the frozen ground should let you slide further. I think I think they forgot that part but you can create ice walls um, you can you can make it rain I got a shaman that just turned on the weather and just started making it rain and then it made lightning work even further because there were puddles that the lightning would shoot through and hit all the enemies I mean they, they really they really put a lot of thought and effort into a lot of that and you got to play it very very tactful all right, I got 20 there, 216. We get what, 90, 90, 180, and 20, so four. Wish I could just set how many I want to buy. Like, I want to buy four. Multi-buy. Wait, do they have that feature? Maybe they do, and I didn't notice it. No, I don't, I don't think they do. Oh wait, we need a we oh we need a 60 pointer here. Look at all these golems are buying. Oh my gosh. We're gonna have a plethora of golems going forward here. A huge plethora of golems. It's going to be nuts. So everybody's like, don't buy golems. Yes, yes, let's buy them. Let's buy them all. <laughs> okay, we, we uh we filled up that team there. Let's see what you fill up a uh, 40 point buck. I'll get that. That'll be good. A 
one. 165. Holy cripes. 165. Let's see, it's 120. I couldn't do 150. I get two of these. Maybe. Maybe a few of these here. If it monsters a golem, yeah, they'll all stay like dead up in the center, you know? 20 and just enough for one of these little Goomba guys. I gotta say this game is is way faster than before now. I, I, I still have some uh, I still have all my it's what sucks I still have all my stats set on my other file on my switch so I'm trying to do other videos for that I still have to use the switch but uh, I kind of wish they would have done this first this would have been so much easier you know all right so we're moving there what about you bye what about you guys all right looking good looking good all right get some more dudes here oh you know what I forgot oh my gosh don't let me forget this please do not let me forget this. I need a healer. <clears throat> Plus doing it like this, you need a lot of healers on your team. You need at least one or two healers per team just to move around, just to do this kind of stuff. It's just gonna be, it's gonna be crazy if you don't. Okay, we got a self healer. We got a tank and we got a super tank in the front line there. That looks pretty good. All right, let's save this up and let's do some more fights here. All right, in the face. Yes, yes, yes. Front line bases with no knights present. Oh, sure. That's a new pop. That's a new pop up. So they did add that. They, they didn't fix the uh, where you're going to move to, but they added pop-ups. So they did do that. So there we go. All right, where to go here? Mr. Big Boy is down there. Well, seeing as how this is that, and that is this. Ooh, should I smash? Should Hulk smash this? I don't know. It's a lot of bombs. And then there's a Rudo here. There's a Rudo with bombs and uh, Thunderbolts. A little weak to that. What about this? Oh my gosh, just super, just, we'll just crush. Crush! All right. Well, we need to get a little stronger before we're gonna try to outpace them. So I can't go there right now. I could, but I don't want to fight all that stuff there. Okay, so we're looking pretty good there. Let's do it. I've come to kick ass. And we're gonna we're gonna wear down Mana Celestia for a bit. And then I don't know if we can well, we might be able to capture. We're gonna have to do a lot of work to capture. Mana Celestia is a big place to capture. Once you finally do, then uh, you're good to go. You're golden. All right, Lorenzo. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Min Yeah, Frost, I'm surprised you haven't used that terminology in, like, ever, or at all. Oh. Uh, so shocking, I'm surprised, man. I'm very surprised. You should have, should have been doing that for the longest time, dude. Oh, no. But yeah, man, if you don't do it, I'm gonna do it. So how about that? Every time I frost PDP somebody, 
They, they take some damage, you know? I cast Frost PDP on all the enemies. Especially my Geno Frost PDP. You know? So I'm still trying to live up to the uh, Helmut Brigandine here with my hat. Oh no, he's in the front! This is actually, if, if you want to do something that's also kind of relaxing, you can just do this too. This is just relaxing. You can uh, just kind of kick back, get a beer, watch it unfold, make bets, make bets on who's going to win, you know? Yeah, that's the whole point of what I'm doing here today. This is just uh, just to see if my guys can... But this is Armchair General. I, I should have titled it that. But being an armchair general, we're just playing the strategies, we're not playing the tactics. So we, we set our troops up with what we think would be good, we sent them out to fight, we did a good job, they'll win. Not, well, maybe they won't win. So it's really trying to, it's really kind of picking the best roster for the team, it's more about that. But also it's just the fun of just, you know, getting to watch and see if you're making the right calls, you know? I feel like that's just too easy a joke. Oh, come on, dude. There are no too easy jokes. I think, actually, in this lifetime, right now, I feel like we're losing a lot of humor. I think I think we, we need more humor in life now. More than ever. More than ever. I grew up with a lot of humor. And uh, I just like to have fun with, with my games, you know? Uh, there's a full generic game called Auto Battlers that are essentially just this. Really? Auto Generic? Must be French, right? Uh. Ooh. They're really trying to be feisty and hold this whole thing, aren't they? I cannot believe Gilsus is. Is, ha is holding on this long. Can you believe that? This glorified unicorn here who calls himself a uh, priest is uh, still alive. Come on, kill him off, man. Thank you. Thank you, Adu. If anybody could do it, I know you could. Bye. Level 20, yes. Aha. Level 20. And they're all gone. I ate all my food. All done. Yum yum eat them up. Yum yum eat them up. Yum yum eat them up. Okay. He didn't even get to do anything. He just sat back there looking, looking cool. That sucks. You can get any experience with that. <sighs> well, it was definitely a good fight. I am very happy we did very well. Good job, boys. Good job. Boys and girls, good job. Everybody. Good job, team. You snaked it. You lizarded it up. And we got a phoenix? I didn't even see that. I must not have been paying attention to that. Time for the walk. Well, have a good walk, Frost. Ooh, we got a... I'm gonna use that. <laughs> I'll definitely use that. Invasion. Yay! It's go time. Yeah, I think we'll go till. I don't know, maybe. Maybe we'll go till 5. Maybe we'll go for another 45 minutes here today because I still have my other stream to do. So we'll probably go till then. And then I'll probably kick off. And then if I got time tomorrow, maybe I'll do another one tomorrow. Or I'll have to plan a schedule possibly because I do have other videos I got to make. Coffee break is over. Time to go. I got to have my ear out while I paint some mountains. Good job, dude. A good job. Um, might I suggest something? Might I suggest something? Let's see where I'm putting my guys first. All right, I don't want Stella in the front. I don't want that. And I don't want that. I want this. And I want Stella in the forest. 
I want Ratka over here. Because they swim through the forest, so I don't want her getting there too fast. You know what I'm saying. Whoa! Cheesy beast! Hey, Cheesy! I think we've talked before, right? Or have we? Let me play this whole version of this. This is worth it. It's asking price. It's pretty fun. I'd have to say this is way more economical, and the price for this is way better than getting it on the Switch. Now, if you like the Switch, you like the consoles, that's great. But if you got a PC, definitely worth it. I can use it. I can use a controller and a mouse at the same time. I can move very, very quickly, get things done very quickly. So I'd have to say this is definitely an upgrade. I wish I'd had all my other save files over here so I could do other things here. But uh, the only the only new thing here that I don't know if you're gonna like or not, but if you press Y, they still have the hit point bar. And the the Alpha Beta Charlie goes away. I want the Alpha Beta Charlie, I want the hit point bar to go away. That's the only thing. But the numbers are nice because you can you don't have to actually click on them, it just shows you right there. Very small though, but you can see the over and under of the, the hit points there, so. Uh, anyways, let's get into it here. But uh, yeah, I'd have to say it's probably an upgrade. Bit of an upgrade there. But how you doing, Cheesy? Uh, we're, I don't know how many more streams I'll do of this. Maybe I'll do maybe once a week or something like that. But uh, I do have interesting scenario that I want to play with the custom mode once once I get to it. So maybe I'll finish this. And next week we'll do like some some fun custom mode things. Because I've got some ideas for stuff. My head can't stay on. I don't know why. My head's kind of too big for the stream now. <laughs> Actually, it looks like I'm wearing a half hat. Never played the old version of this? Yeah, I'd have to say, if you want to play the old version, the old version is still a lot of fun. There's MUs you can get for Dolph 2. Uh, there's no... I don't think you... I don't know if you can buy a working copy of it anymore. Maybe you can, if you can find it. But... I do play the multiplayers of the older version on Fridays. And if you don't have enough people there, then we'll play a different game, like Streets of Rage or something. Interesting. But uh, the old version is still a lot of fun. The old version has the multiplayer settings for it, which a lot of people keep asking about, but is only really going to be in the old version. I don't think they ever had any intention of making a multiplayer for this because the fact is they never truly balanced out the countries. Because if I look at the countries and I were to try to play them against each other, I don't think some countries would even remotely have a fair chance. I don't think Shinobi or Morelva would have a fair chance because you come down in two different directions from either way and two different countries could just push them and take them out immediately. It's a one line drive. Same thing for Shinobi as well. Two countries could come in and push them and they'd be dead. There's no alternate way for them to go, they would just get crunched, you know? Uh, full price. Well, it's not as bad as the other one. I think it's 30... 37 or almost 40, I think. So, it is still kind of expensive, but it's not as expensive as all the other new games that come out that are like 60 to 80 bucks, you know? So, if you get the, the full edition, which I did back then, I got the... The biggest one I could, it was like 80 bucks for like the collector's edition, which is a lot of money. But uh, it's, you get some cool stuff. You got a little baseball card in there too, which is cool. Uh, soundtrack, a lot of art, which is nice. You know, uh, a lot like Fire Emblem with a lot more going on. Yeah, uh, the only difference with this and Fire Emblem is the knights they get injured. And they're out for about a month of being injured on a rot on an injured status. But the monsters are permanently dead unless you have an item to res them. That's only if you get an item to res them. But this game is ridiculously generous with that option. You can set that in a custom mode and like always get res items and basically play this like you're playing a Pokemon game, I guess. I don't I I don't know if it's 
similar to Pokemon, but I don't, not really similar to Pokemon, but everybody keeps using a Pokemon reference for whatever reason. I don't know why. I think people should use a chess reference for this more so, because this is more like playing a chess game, or like playing a Final Fantasy Tactics game, or like playing, you know, hexagonal shape tactics game, stuff like that. It's, it's, but yeah, Fire Emblem does fit the bill too, you know, especially with that. Um, with that there. The only difference is that you don't have perma permadeath for the knights themselves. They always come back. Like a bad penny. They always come... No, I'm kidding. <laughs> let me know when there there's a sale. Well, yeah, I'll let you know if there's a sale. Uh, they did do a sale for PlayStation, though. I think they did a pretty big sale on PlayStation some time ago. I can't remember how much. I think it was like 10, 20% off. So maybe it's uh, cheaper. I haven't looked for the actual prices, so don't quote me on prices uh, for PlayStation or Switch, but it's definitely cheaper than it was before. Because they went to that. But there we go. Armchair, armchair General victory. Success. Uh, we got Sophie up a little bit more, so we can do a little more with her. Got a Phoenix. We got some good stuff. And I can pull up, pull away that other team that hasn't been able to do anything yet, and I can build them into something here. You know? Are you the guy that reads the cards? I... I read... I've read cards. Yeah. I do it sometimes. Uh, gay <laughs> statue. How you doing today? I have done that in the past, but uh, it got. Eh. Man, it, that's like a lot of work. That is a lot of work. It's so much work. I, I don't have the energy to do it. I, I, I wish I did. I just don't have the energy to do it. I it, it takes so much. I can't believe how much energy it takes. Those people that do that, that's interesting that they can do it like, as easily as they do it. I just don't have the energy anymore, unfortunately. I feel sad too. Brigadine is a ton of work. Brigadine is a lot of strategic stuff. Now this, this for me, I don't get overwhelmed with. I really don't. I don't know why. I don't know why strategy games is like... I don't know. It's like it's like throwing ball with your dad in the backyard. It's like it's it just comes naturally to me. I just love to do it, and I've always liked to do it. 15% uh, off Steam release week. Yes, so you get a really good boon for it right now. But if you want to wait, I guess wait till Christmas, and then you might get a uh, you you might get it done with an extra. I don't know percentage off but I think it's only I think I only spent like 38 bucks with the purchase here which I, I kind of wish I don't know I kind of wish I could have somehow gotten a free copy already of owning the game uh, multiple times <laughs> but anyways all right let's put some stuff together here so we're doing an auto uh, game we're doing a armchair general game so we're just sitting here, we're building the team, making sure it's strong enough, trying to set them the right way. Hopefully they'll get the win. So far we've been successful. You, you can be unsuccessful. It's, uh, it is a thing. But, uh... Hey, thanks for the, uh, follow there. I don't know why it's not at the top, but... Uh, we hear some nice music for the follow there. I know why. I know why. I put this at the very top. Let's see here. Yeah, I got it before the alerts. There we go. Cheesy. Need some sugar. Thanks for the uh, thanks for the follow, cheesy. And uh, guys, if you could help, if you could help follow the channel, that'd be great. Uh, we're we're pretty close to a thousand. I mean, not like really close, but we're kind of close. If you could help me get there. That'd be awesome. I'm doing a lot of triangle strategy games, like I keep saying every once in a while. Check it out. It's on YouTube. A lot of fun. It's it, Triangle strategy, I have to say, is probably a little more difficult than this game because you have to play the environments. You have to work the actual environments in your environment. 
and it's uh, not easy. It is not easy. And I'm playing it on just normal right now, but it's um, it's fun, and it's cool. And it's like a mixture of uh, Bomb Lagoon and Final Fantasy Tactics. Kind of a mixture of that. But, uh, yeah, no problem. Um, I'd like to do more of these, but I do have a lot of Twitch streams at night. You know? I subbed, but that Holy Republic... You subbed, but the Holy Republic angers you? The Holy Republic angers you? Why does the Holy Republic anger you? Uh, oh, you mean the enemy that I fought? Hmm. Yeah, they're, they're, um, Bruto is, Bruto is not a good guy. Bruto is like, what, Bruto is like, uh, if Zemeckis could just be like that much worse, that's Bruto. Yeah, he's, he's, uh, terrible, terrible person. Just inside and out. Okay, so we got... Wait, didn't that work? This isn't the Eunice class. Well, why not? Oh, I can't class up right now. I'm kidding. Um, here we go. Enchantress. Okay, did we get... Oh, uh, we're not all the way through it yet. Okay, here's what I do. I class over, go back to my class and class up, just so that is uh, done. All right, now she's back to proficiency of four. You gotta have proficiency of five to switch around, switch Uh You do Twitchy, what's the name? Veracity two, that's Veracity Trigger on Twitch. So if you wanna check me out at night, you can do that. Most nights I'm streaming on Twitch, so if I do some streams here, then maybe I'll do it on YouTube, but that's a lot of time and also it kind of takes out some time to make some videos. So I've got other videos I have to make. So I probably can do maybe a stream a week, maybe more. Uh, I'll have to see. I, I finally have some more time to work on things. So possibly. I have to find out, you know. All right. We got all the, look at all these golems here. Just I'm going to make a whole row of, of golems. There we go. Perfect. Fits right for you, Sophie. Enjoy. Definitely enjoy all your golems here. It's you. I follow your banner. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the follow. Thank you. I the... follow your banner. Thank you for the follow. Stay triggered. That's my that's my saying. That's my logo. Summon. Oh, thank God. We got healers. Uh, apparently so, yes. <laughs> no, don't do that. Get over there. Well, that's very nice. Thank you so much for that. Click right here. Alright. Speed runs. I I did one speed run. I haven't tried a lot of them. But I did one speed run at one point. Maybe I'll do another one? Maybe? Maybe? Ooh, another 70. I can get all of the things? Wait a second. No, maybe I got a better idea. But, uh, yeah, everybody, thanks for the follow. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, let's... Perfect. Oh, that's perfect. Okay, we got 91. Summon unicorns. RPG hero. The RPG hero. Well, I do have a nice hero. Are you the nice hero? That comes by a lot. No, I think that's that's a different guy. Look at all that. Look at all that. Finally, we got a decent uh, we got a decent team there. Okay, cool. Should I backtrack though? Because this is kind of exposed. 
Or... Ooh, they didn't even attack me at all. Oh, I can take full advantage of that. Full advantage. Complete advantage. What a waste. But, uh, yeah, no problem, Cheesy Beast. Hope everybody's doing it today. How's everybody doing that's just joined me? Let me know in the chat. Let me know what you're, if you've got this game, if you're playing it, how far you've gotten so far. If you're new to the game, I could give some tutorial stuff. I've already got some tutorial videos made on YouTube you could check out. Uh, yeah, I will probably have to make some more. I do believe I had some other ones I had to run as well. But uh, this Grand Edition and the original, you know, you're the cringy hero. <laughs> Jeez. Wow. Self-burn. Ouch. Okay, you know what actually we should probably do? Oh, we're going to stay here, double attack, take them both out at the same time. He can't move everywhere, you know? Yeah, he can't move everywhere. All right, let's build another team here. Or can we? Hold the phone. Maybe we can't. I think we might be out. Holy cripes. Look at all the levels ups. A bunch of blue snakes. I love blue snakes. Can be... Nope, 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 nope. You're already a Viking, Jenny. You don't need to be another Viking. You don't need to be a, a double Viking. It's like two scoops. Viking class for a dew. Good stuff there. Love it. And we get uh, more blue snakes. All right. Yeah, fortunately, we're a little too high and heavy. So let's do... What are we going to do? What are we going to do? 30? Oh, we got to bring out a 40 right there, right? Okay, then we got 80, 80, and a 50. Can we do this? Yes. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. All right, we got... Boom, boom, boom. Can I switch through any more stuff around here? To make the game so much better, right? We got 80. No. 65. Does that do it? Oh, it kind of does it. We got all the healers here, though. We might have to bring a healer in here. I can't think of anything else. I think that's good enough, to be honest. Okay, so we do have an extra guy there. We could utilize. We do have this full team. We didn't really equip him yet. And we got to try to build another squad. So I think we're going to build it with Pluto here. So let's just buy everything we can. Because why not? Uh, we'll get... Uh, yeah, we'll get one demon here. Why not? But, uh, alright, we got a snickety snake. And we're probably going to get a bunch of giants. I don't know. I don't know what else to do. Probably going to have to be something like that. Over 25. 60 and 135. 60. get this guy here. We can get this guy here. That's 60, and then 135 would be... Well, it'd be probably like two of these dudes, and... And then... A mermaid. Alright, here we go. Good. All right, got two more guys there. Can we get another set of troops? Uh, he's only still at seven. Maybe we'll go with Vigo. Vigo Mortison, right? Oh, no, Galavard. Galavard's better. 130. Summon. 130. We do 35, 70. That's up to 140. Or that's 130, so 250. Can't do 135. 
I'm gonna do three and then and we'll see what we can do from there. That's all we can do. That's all, folks. And I think that's all the spacing we can do, too, as well. So, all right. Okay, I... Hmm. I hate to say it, but I'm going to have to let them take my eat up my territory for a bit. I can't defend it with the new ragtag team I just bought. It's too weak. It's too simplistic. Right? Okay, I have an idea, though. All right, we'll bring that team up here. We'll defend over there. Now that we got our options set. Send them over there, and we'll send this other team that we just got set. Right over here. Okay. Okay, we got a new team built. Get this team here. Do you notice a game kind of like darkens when you click on our castle? Do you notice that? I didn't notice that before. Okay, good. Good, good, good. I was really hoping to actually like beat the game today, but it's gonna take so long. This guy, I keep forgetting how long this game takes to beat. We might leave ourselves open for a little bit, but we'll bring a, an established good team back in here to recap this and go through this later and uh, get some work going, you know? All right, so I think we got things set. All right, are we good here? Yeah, we're good there. Okay, manage items. Let's do this real quick. Power pill, yes. Stella. Power potion. Stella. <laughs> I'm making Stella like ridiculously strong here. Light sword. Crimson rod. Give it to Sophie. Wisdom rod. Lorenzo. Oh, I can't do that. That's right. Guard hat. Uh, da, da, da. I'll give it to him here. Steel midnight. Ooh, that's a cool name. Uh, you should set it on the fast on the Switch 2. Really helpful and easy battles. That's what I'm doing right now. We're doing on the uh, the fast mode here. Uh, blue amulet. Wait, what was this again? Blue dot defense. Do I really need that? Blue dot defense. Uh, it's going to really hurt me, though. There's not a lot of greens in this game, you know, even with the mandrakes and stuff. There's not too many greens. I think we'll give it to... Give it to Pluto then. But how's your day going, uh, Steel Midnight? That's a really interesting name there. How did you manage to get that? Let's do a Fine Protector. Got some Fine Protectors here. We'll give it to... We'll keep the Nightmare alive, sure. And then we'll give it to Soul. And uh, that's all we got for items. I love how you can just fly through this. And plus with the mouse, I can just go click, 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 and like do things really fast if I want to do that. So I've got multiple, multiple options there, which is really nice. All right, let's um, save her up here. Shave her up. And let's go, end of phase. Most underrated strategy game, I know. I know. It's because, I don't know. I mean, I see all these advertisements. Do you see advertisements for like Hero Wars or something like that? I see this all over the time. It's just, it's all these easy games. And yeah, it's fun to play an easy game sometimes, but I like to play a fun easy game if I'm on the road, if I'm in a doctor's appointment or something like that, just waiting and I just want to kill some time. I don't have to think about anything. But like, if you want like, you know, some real powerful game, it's gonna let you think a lot. Open your brain waves, you know, open your mind. Let you, like, really enjoy life. Like, you can, like, feel satisfied when you when you win a battle. This is one of those games. All right. Time to do it. Everybody, go! Good. 
going to capitalize on eating up this territory. Uh, we just got a new baby team here. This is our new baby team. Uh, it's got Pluto in it, though, so he's very good. Oh, that's right. I got a tournament of healers, so we can actually get some heals off this. And then those two guys can go swing around and do tons of damage. All right, since we're doing that, this team's coming up here. Bing, bada, boom. We're going to eat up all this territory, like, right quick. If we lose some places here, I'm okay with it, because all we got to do is just bring a team back to Ilvany and just walk right back up here. But I just want to cap off this territory so we can, like, get Mana Celestia gone, you know? But thanks, everybody. You know, I forgot to thank everybody. Thanks, everybody, for voting uh, with the YouTube message that I put out there. Most people voted for Mana Celestia or Morelva. I put it in the chat because uh, YouTube only has five voting things you can vote for, so you can't vote for all six countries. They only let you vote for five things. So I had to... I had to leave a message saying, hey, if you want this one or the other, put it in the comments and YOLO. Uh, but uh, Morelva's picked, so we're, that's what we're doing here. All right, so we're going to have a double pincer attack, both sides. They can't escape. I'm higher that way. I'm higher that way, points-wise. Uh, they can't escape. I'm higher than them, too. This team will probably come down and start eating up territory here, too. This is going to be fantastic. So yeah, if they attack me, whatever, I don't care. I'll just come back here later on and recap it. Capping the center takes a lot of energy, and so I think that's the best way to go for it. Let's do it. Let us do it. So they put Ruto there. They have an angel. They have some stuff. This could be a hell of a fight. I hope we, I hope we win here. We got some good quality monsters, all blue monsters right now. You know, all quality stuff. So let's see here. But I am... This is armchair general settings. Armchair general is, is literally just... I I just... You know, I tell them what to do and I, I watch them do it, you know? So let's try to set this up right. Lorenzo will be in the middle. We'll put... I don't know if I want to do on top. Maybe we'll put uh, Guinea on top. And we'll put a do... Uh, or maybe not. I don't know. Put it. No, no, I don't want to do on the bottom though. All right, go with that. We <laughs> <laughs> supposed to catch a, a prize like Man of Celestia's King Rudo. I learned lessons from those free online games with Raid. There are money vacuums. You never feel like you're getting anywhere except when you spend money. I'll stick to consoles, brother. Yeah. I played Clash of Clans some years ago when it came out, and unfortunately, I'll tell you, I did spend a little money on that. And then after a few battles and stuff, somebody just literally raided and stole all of my money, literally that I invested into the game to build this particular thing because, like, most of my gold and stuff was gone. And after that, I was like, never again. I'm not doing that anymore. No more of that. But uh, we're also going to old school cowboy brigandine here. So I'll try to wear the hat if, if I can. But if it falls off, then I can't do anything about that. I love that they're actually kind of coming out after me with this. They're not even going to defend their castle. I don't know if that's a good idea. Man, he's, he, he thinks he can beat my team. He's got, that's why he's racing after me right now. That's why. That's why he's racing. You see them? They're like, we can beat you. Ruto is very confident right now. Oh gosh, he did the big move on my blue dragon. Well, it's good he didn't do it on my leader, obviously, right? Dude, we're gonna kill both of their big birds. Oh, we're gonna totally smash both these big birds. Woof! 
And our whole team is so far behind, too. Yahoo! 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 Oh, and they healed up the dragon, too. Turn four. Oh, he killed my lizard man. Oh, we got a siren. Can we get a chain effect? Bye bye. Take it down the birds. Rudo is good at stuff, but I don't know about contending with a bunch of Vikings. That's a whole nother story, right there. Ah, sorry, Cyrus the virus, but you are gone. We set this up pretty good so far. No, dude, he killed off my siren. Get him. Go sick him. Get out of here, Rudo. Killed the rude guy. Good. Done. Whew. Done with that. And there you have it. We picked the right kind of team. It seems so far. Did pretty well there. And up against Rudo, nonetheless, you know. And in this setting, everybody gets two times experience. So if the enemy beats me, well, they're just going to get ridiculously strong if they end up beating me. Which they could. There probably will be some battles. I mean, Elza's going to be hard to fight. I'll just say that right now. She's going to be really, really tough to fight. And we lost a couple things. Yeah, I don't, I don't do the whole... I don't do the whole money thing anymore. And check out the Gollum lineup we got with Sophie. <laughs> it's it's going to take her a while to get there. <laughs> it's going to take her a while to get there. She's going to be like, come on, guys, you can do it. And you're like, one step at a time. We'll make it. All right, which one is a little bit quicker? Yeah, I want to try to get Sophie into that quicker. Okay, Raka, you can be up there. Uh, yeah, sure. We'll give Sophie the road here. Give Sophie the road. Go! It's gonna take a while for her to get there. Nightmare, we just got him. Dude, they just they just charged me there. That was ridiculous. They had no reason to do any of that. Nice, we're at level 20. Two hit combo kill. Oh, Aisha. Oh, man. That sucks. Bye. 
Thanks for playing. Well, that was fast. <laughs> they just charge right out to me and get killed immediately, and that's over. I think we were gonna definitely win that one anyways. Oh, proficiency! Yes, she's done! We can, we can change her back, she's got heals. She can be a full-time caster now if we want. We might even run with this whole team of golems, to be honest. some coffee. Yay! And there was much rejoicing. Yay! Good job, sir. Good job. Achievement unlocked. Relva has invaded. Sagust. A bunch of demons versus a bunch of non-demons. With one demon. It's go time. It is definitely go time. Let's do this. Alright, who is center stage here? That is the thing. Maybe Umamaro? Yeah. Yeah, I think it's going to have to be like that. And then, uh, oh, why is she so much further down? No, let's do her. And then we'll go Sherrod. See, I don't know why they do this. I don't know why they don't put, put me center, left, and then right, like I could go A, B, and then put C on top of where the uh, the stream is, because, I mean, that would kind of make sense. I'll be right back. あるすんきょうに見せてあげたいな。敵軍へ警告。武装解除推奨。武装解除。何を言う。この町で可愛がってあげるわ。ピーブン。友好的発言検知。可愛がる。愛情表現。な、何を言ってるの？覚悟しなさい。とことん可愛がってあげる。大幅な愛情表現更新。海丸嬉しい。Okay, what did I miss? What did I miss? Oh, actually, I heard the whole thing. Um, that's kind of a funny little thing there. That goes on with those two. Okay, let's see what we're going to do and do it. All right, so we got to face off against this team here. Uh, this could be a... I don't know if it's going to be a tough fight. Might be, might not be. But we'll find out. Okay. Back sore? Is your back sore? Is that what you're trying to say? My back was a little sore today. Now it's doing kind of okay. I do need to get out and go for a walk too, so I'll probably do that as well. But, uh... Oh gosh, that's a lot of cursing in the front lines there. Well, that too. Okay. Oh, 
Get the Phoenix way back there too. Whoa! There goes our cannon shot. Really adding Zor postfix to the word makes it like it's hard to explain. It's an old thing, but basically just means I'm back. Oh, okay. Good, good. We got a demon down. Killed one of those demons. Get so many cursings on our uh, main character here. Ooh, we got some stuff here too. What do you know? Oh, yikes. Nice. I'm a little worried with Uvamaro because if he gets, I mean, he can handle the curse because he's Black Dot anyways, but if he gets four or three of them in a row, if he would have got triple cursed the whole time, that would have been absolutely something there. Nice! Pulling off the area heal. So you think that the Phoenixes won't do an area heal, but they do do area heals. They do do. Yeah, that's a word. Um. Good. I just wish they'd take down, take down some of these mages here. Instead of worrying about go golems all day. You know, golems are so important to kill, right? Oh. We did it! We did it! The win! We didn't take a casualty yet. Wow, she blended in so well, I thought she was my, my character for a second. I was like, they're fighting something there, right? What is that? <laughs> Kidding. I guess, I guess Ginger and Uemaro's game is basically done. They set the rules. And it's kind, of, it's kind of done now. Victory! There we go. Got little Uemaro, his victory, his well-deserved victory. It was awesome. Well-deserved. And there we go. There we go. Okay, we did lose a couple things. They did lose a lot of things. Which is really good for us. Fierce disposition, still Hammett's troops. Oh, I'll just keep going, apparently. Recruit the most exceptional knights. How are we gonna be able to do that? さあさあ、我こそは<笑> この口で言って何人の若造を悪の道に誘い込んだことかってな。金、金、金。金さえ掴めば酒も女も思い通りさ。
悪かったね思い通りにならなくって<笑>そういう女はな放っておくとコロッと向こうからケツ振ってやってくるもんよ気長に待ってやるさ<笑> Probably have a world map finished for the next day. Next day, I'm going to have a world map finished for the next day. Oh, you know what? I don't know how you're drawing your, your, your mountains and all that, but. Ah, Stella. Tying in a shaka dako. Yeah, I don't know what program you. Well, I usually use GIMP. I, I know there's Adobe and stuff. There's some, some interesting features for like. You know, you can uh, add some extra texture. Tablet on Photoshop. Oh, okay. Yeah, do you have like a like a sunset or a sun that moves around in there? If you do, you, you could put some like little red edging on the mountains to make it give that little bit of a glow, like the sun's behind it. I don't know. I don't know how you got. Uh, like I saw a uh, little bit of the video that you put out there with that. Um, but I don't know if you can get a sun to go through the background, you know, with like layers and stuff. I don't know if you can. Uh, well, you probably can do that. But I don't know how you're gonna design it. <sighs> artist rendition of an artist rendition of map for generals to gather around. There you go. Find her father, Guineum Hat. Guineum Hammett. Guineum is his actual full name. He'll test strength again, a man, a full two heads his size. Gotcha. <laughs> 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 His opponent breaks the last guy's neck. You <laughs> should sailed, old man. It is when the glow of your past and your current abilities are no longer. <laughs> It's one of the funniest things Yomamaro says. <laughs> you ship a sailed old man. <laughs> no faith. No faith in, in, in Ginium's abilities or Ginny's abilities there, you know? Alright, let's uh, do some leveling up. How about we get one of each? Huh? How about that, huh? Yeah, yeah. How about that? One of each. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that. There we go. Salt and pepper. That's what we're going to call them. If I were going to name them. But I'm not. So I don't have time for that. Well, I mean, I do have some time. Actually, I could. If you guys want a name, I could do it. Because um, we're at 5 o'clock. I, I, uh, I have to get some stuff set. So I'm going to do this. And I think I'm going to have to close it down here, but uh, maybe next week, maybe Wednesday, we can do more. Maybe I'll start a little earlier or something like that, but uh, I don't know. But, um, yeah, we'll have to see here. We'll have to see. Ooh, I got I got to do a lot of classing here. Let's, uh, you are proficient. You should probably be a mage now. So you could do all the heals and all those things. That'd be beautiful. You're proficient, but I like that. Uh, summon. Uh, if it at, if you glance at the end of the devlog, I started zooming out. You can see what the. Yeah, I did see some of. Yeah. Um. You have a full content made, don't you? I think I saw you have full content. It'll look like southwest corner of the map. Wait. So we don't get to see the outcome of Ginny's fight? Who wrote this? 
They burn the climax. Yeah, I know. I know. That's the one thing I still like about Grand Edition better is they actually do finish most of the stories, but some stories aren't really truly finished. Like, there's definitely some, like the one with uh, Sophie and Philo, they go on a little quest to meet, or they, they talk about their time where they met Solon, and, you know, like, they could, could do that again, and then it never happens. Uh, but at least a lot of the, the characters do kind of, like, sort of mesh together pretty well. I think Morelva does the best job with meshing characters together here. The other countries, probably Republic Grimold does a bit, Shobi does a bit, Manus Lessie doesn't do hardly any meshing at all, it's really just all about Rudo, for the most part. Uh, Holy Ghost of Empire is all about their own bloodline, about their family, and Rubino is all about, uh, well, Rubino. So Rubino and Rudo are really all about themselves, for the most part. That's what I see. If you see something different, please tell me, but that's what I see so far with that. Wow. Class proficiency, cleric. Do a healer. Uh, or should we do an enchantress? Okay, Geno Frost. Form yep, yep, yep. That'd be good. We could get a lot done that way. All right, let's let's try to move some of this around. We got another little guy in here. Probably fit into the team. Have to see how we can fit him though. Yeah, five. I could put to there. It's almost there. What are we gonna do? Maybe I gotta put everything on the top here. Fifty-nine. Uh. I don't know. I can't see the way we need to do this right now. All right, we'll just we'll just leave it like that for now. It's good enough for me. All right, this team here. This team, we probably can make a better assortment here, right? We got 38. I got two of these here. I think that's a little. Oh, we got three of them. That's too, too many. That's way too many. We don't need all that. 60 points. Go in mass. Or go with the Wyvern. Ah, yeah, I think the Wyvern is a better call right now. That'll finish things up, and uh, then we can get rocking and rolling. That'll be perfect. All right, Tommy, I think you will stay as a ranger. But most other people aren't going to stay as a ranger here. Ooh, the classes, the classes. Have oh, we got so much stuff to class up here. Holy cow! Blue snake, the blue snakey snake. We got ourselves a Kowatl. Got ourselves a better Umamaro. It's looking pretty good. Okay, so uh, that fits there. Let's see, what is going to fit where and why? So that's 75, 80, and will that do it? Yeah, that'll, that works perfectly. All right, 
she's good where she's at. I like her as that. I just want to stay right there. 130. Summon. Yes. 130. One of each. It's perfect. I'll take all the garbagey monsters you can give me. Thank you. They're all terrible, but I'll make them into something great. Okay, we did this, we did this. Yeah, we did that. And we did that. And we did that. Oh, that's right. I was trying to fit... It. I might be able to math this out and, and fit this in there, but... For whatever reason, I can't seem to think about it right now. What is it? Do put this up there? No. Ah, whatever. I don't really care. We'll we'll get to it later. All right. So here's the map. That's what we got. Let's do a. Uh, how do we do that again? We go. Click here. Manage items. That's where we go. All right. Got a couple new things. Crimson rat. No apical people to equip. Oh, we don't have any healers anymore. Oh, that's right. I'll give it to Sophie because she's on the, the team that probably needs it the most. What is this? Steel protector. I think we'll give it to that guy. All right, and we're good. What do you say? I should live stream episode 50 of my campaign or just keep doing recordings? Uh, are you doing the live streams? I mean, you're asking me, like, what we should do as a whole, like, stream to YouTube or stream to Twitch. I don't, I don't really think, I don't really care what anybody does. Um, go Twitch, go YouTube. If you feel like doing it live, you know, then do it live, you know. Uh, why a tiny bit? That's a little different. It's I think there's more complex settings in here. Twitch is so much easier uh, with that because I got to... Because I, I put up a link there that wasn't even the link. It's like, uh, you know, stream this thing, and it that wasn't the link. And it's got, I don't know. I th I think it. I think streaming as a general works a little better on Twitch, but um, you know, I'd like to do some stuff for YouTube as well. Because I always put up some, I always put up a lot of videos on YouTube, but uh, I used to stream on YouTube. A lot and then they stopped because I'm an affiliate and so you can't really uh, you can't have two of the same streams going to the same platform at the same time it's against twitch's rules and because you're kind of technically getting paid you're kind of working that angle they don't want you to stream to anything other than that so this has nothing to do with twitch this is just strictly for YouTube and that's when I was doing the restream thing right stream to both places and I actually did enjoy that. I kind of almost missed doing that, but uh, since I can't do that anymore because I'm in uh, the, the whole contract thing with the affiliate stuff, uh, I have to do this separately. So uh, this will probably be once a week thing. If I get more time, then I'll just throw it up there randomly and we'll we'll do that. But if not, then, uh, then we'll just have some fun with this when I get the chance. But uh, kind of feel like maybe I'll pick up when you leave off. <laughs> really? Is that, a, is that a fact? It seems like we'll all be streaming at some point. Valkus does the morning times. I'm not always available in the morning times uh, when he's going. So I, get you, I catch him when I can. And if other people stream at another time, do you, wanna, do you want me to come check you out? I can. Uh, I just gotta have the time to do so. But I also have a lot of work that I work on behind the scenes possible jobs and 
work and then plus making videos for YouTube takes does take a, a while so thanks everybody for subscribing that does help I, I hope we can uh, keep growing um, and uh, yeah and all that so that's that's as far as we got today I, I'm just gonna call it here I've got some other stuff I gotta do I gotta do a twitch stream tonight once or Wednesdays come by twitch if you want to check out uh, Wanzers and fighting with Raging Paul he's here with me and uh, we're getting close to the end of the game and so we'll be doing that but um, in the future if I have like a straight up free day and I've got everything cleaned out maybe I'll do like a I don't know if I can do a 24 hour marathon I kind of slept through one marathon before <laughs> I didn't even know that I slept through one I like woke up in the morning and I had, I think I had someone else like message me like your stream is still on I'm like what it should be off uh, so I think everybody fell asleep well I fell asleep but uh, uh, I don't know I don't know what happened to that thing I think it was too big in it anyways but um, maybe I'll do a marathon at some point here but I'd have to have some suggestions and I know I did leave a message in the past other people did reply a lot of people replied like should I do something new and interesting or should I do a new Brigadine challenge or something like that and most of you voted for a Brigadine challenge so that's what I'm going to try to set up here and I'm going to try to set up a challenge for the game but as I'm just playing through here the armchair general stuff they won't allow me to do the creator stuff unless I beat the game so maybe I'll do that and uh, maybe next week we'll play something interesting, you know, a uh, pretty interesting mode in some interesting new way. But uh, yeah, we'll see for that. So, so uh, yeah, thanks everybody for coming by. I'll see you probably next week, probably same time, uh, same, same bad time, same bad channel. Uh, we'll, we'll see, see you then. And uh, maybe it'll be something new. Maybe it'll be this. I'll have to see. But uh, it's, it's interesting. And if other people do want to do some kind of new interesting challenge with me, or you want to give me a challenge, I give you a challenge, we could play that game. But we have to talk about that first, because I'd like to maybe set some... There are not really a lot of ground rules, but if there are, you know. Uh, I'm just marathoning until either I beat Gamol or I have to go back to work, and I'll be done with streaming for a little while. Okay. Well, good luck with that, man. That's um, I don't have the time to watch marathons. I can come by and watch some stuff other people are doing, but I can't watch like everything. I've just, I've got a lot of in real life work uh, I've got to do, and uh, so, so yeah. But I will come by and root you on if you let me know, and all that. So I don't know what else to say. I guess have a good night, everybody. I don't really have an outro for this. I I mean, I, I kind of do, but it's mostly for Twitch streaming, so I'll leave that for Twitch. But uh, nobody voted for the Holy Republic. The Holy Republic of... Oh, oh, the Theocracy? Hmm. Did they? Or maybe they... Yeah, you're right. I, maybe nobody did. Need to pay. Need to, need to pay? What are you going to pay? Huh? No worries. All right. So, yeah, come on by. I also have Subscribe Star. I'll have to put that in uh, the the listing down below if uh, you want to help out that way instead. You know, you could do something like that. I've got different ways and stuff like that. But that's if you you know feel the need. But otherwise, uh, if you want to know what's going on in my life, I don't ha I don't even use Facebook anymore. I don't use any of that stuff. Uh, it's, it feels more like a old MySpace kind of thing. But like, if you want to know what's going on, I'm on Discord. You can check out what I'm going to be doing on Discord. You can talk in the chat if you want. Uh, you can do pretty much anything. I'm going to probably set up other streamers sections in there for like things for you know people to put out their stuff. Because I just have like an all section. But if people want to have their own particular section on my Discord, I can set that up. Just let me know so I can do that because I have uh, I have a plan I thought I needed to use this boost thing but I don't think I need to use the boost to be able to do it but uh, be back on line an hour but you're good sorry this morning all right so uh, yeah if you want to check out uh, too technical
go check him out on uh, YouTube and Valko Sonare and uh, Frost BDP, and you can check them out, watch their own Burgundine stuff. They've got uh, some content. I know Valkos and Frost and I have the most Brigandine content that I that I know so far. But technical, I think you're getting your uh, I think you're getting your feet wet here. So this is uh, quite a bit of a project, I'd have to say. It's a lot of a lot of little nuances to to learn with all the different uh, things in Brigandine, especially. Also, especially if you want to check out the multiplayer we got going on Wednesday, come by on Twitch at about uh, be about 6 p.m. Central Standard Time on Twitch. We start the Brigandine multiplayer, so that's on Grand Edition. And on Grand Edition, there are so many extra little things that are in the game that somebody will tell me like, oh, I can just beat the game however. I do a challenge mode. I do whatever. I, mean, I just do anything. Grand Edition is different. If you don't occupy the castle by turn 12, you lose. It's not the same way in L LOF. In LOF, you can run around all over the place, and if the enemy leaves and you run off into a forest, you still win because, you know, they didn't beat you. Uh, so there's different nuances with the Grand Edition and LOF, different ways to play the game, and so that's kind of a thing. But, um, yeah, anyways, I'll see you next week for this, or maybe come by on Friday for a multiplayer or whatever but uh yeah i got nothing left to say good night i'll see you uh, hopefully tonight on twitch or i'll see you later sometime take care everybody